All right, what's going on, everybody? Gibby Card Stacks here. I got a free hobby box, got a free card. I'm going to tell you how I did it, and let's talk about it. All right, smaller mail day. Let's see what we've got here. Oh, I thought I already got this. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I picked up another Soresby, but this is a Brennan, Brendan Soresby, one of one with honors. I think I got this for under eight bucks or so. Mystic might have sent this to me in the Discord. So I've been buying him up. He's in Bowman. So I've got plenty of his Leaf stuff. I'll probably buy some of his Bowman, but just thought that was too cheap for a one one color match. Cincinnati quarterback. I like it. All right, so here's my free card that I got. I also mentioned I got a free hobby box. We'll talk about it, but this I got on Collects. Collects for Halloween sent out a $10 credit to everyone on the platform. It was good for like 24 hours, 48 hours, something like that. Was browsing around and found this card. Used my free credit for it. No Fafita Blue. I like the 1991 design a lot. The color match is nice. Nine of nine right there. Not having a great year, just O-line issues, which is tough. In my opinion, that's, that's I think, where it all kind of stems from. Does it feel like a step down in coaching staff a little bit? But it is what it is. I'm going to be buying his Bowman for sure. This was a lot that I picked up from China. Oh, wow, that's a very thick card. Got these three cards. I don't remember how much I paid for it, but uh, I just thought it was a good deal. I don't remember which one made me want to buy it first, but this is a Juju Watkins gem patch basketball relic car this is super thick oh god and it's like stained at the top what's going on there um this is massive so that's unfortunate it's just like stained it looks like a drop of coffee or something um i think i paid about 30 bucks for this i just thought it was decent now oh, that's pretty scratched up right now can you see that maybe not um it's like right there. Wow, it's, this is not great condition. I wonder if that was disclosed. But um, yeah, this I think was like 20 bucks. I, I'd seen this on Com C and it's like 50 bucks. I think they do about 40. So I just wanted to pick that up, but not thrilled about the, the coffee stain and then that scratch there. Um, but that, yeah, I think I paid 50 bucks for all this. Hannah Hidalgo, nice little print line there, which is unfortunate, but you don't see the extractors pop up one or two per hobby box. So been buying up some X Fractors. I don't mind. And then uh, Madison Booker. Been oh, I got Madison Booker in the background. I don't know. She's right there. Uh, been buying these up quite a bit as well. Went pretty heavy. This one's pretty centered as well. The centering's pretty awful. You know, the back is pretty rough there. So not bad. Um, I'm fine with the Madison Booker, but a little disappointed in the Juju. But oh well. Okay, so this one, I did not mean to have like a themed background. I don't think I have any Matthew Sluka cards coming up, but Shadur Sanders also in the background. I just pluck three cards and just kind of from, from my, either my Zion case or my three, two row. Uh, but Shadur Sanders, big kahuna, not a huge kahuna guy. Not a big kahuna guy. <laughs> um, that was, that was tough. Um, yeah, just not a huge insert guy. I'd rather just buy the first. I'd rather buy two Sapphire first or an X Fractor or, I don't know, just inserts sometimes are tough. But I think if you're patient, like you can get this or his variation at auctions for like 30 bucks and relist it for 50 or 60. I think that's definitely a game you can play, but I just don't think they're super desirable in the grand scheme of things. I think just you look at sales, transaction and volume, I think just the first are selling well enough whatever. Um, but I've been buying Shutter Sanders. Why, Gaby? Because he's not in this 2024 release. And I just, something in my soul just tells me he'll be, you know, Cam Ward. And eh, we'll see. Um, I don't know really who else would I get. People like Garrett Nussmeyer, but I think Shadur is still probably going to be one of the most hyped up quarterbacks come draft time. So that's my thought process there. You just see all these teams, whether there's validity to it or not, who knows, like Miami or Dallas. And they're all like, oh, we're super interested I don't know, or, you know, GMs are saying. Another Shadur here. I don't I don't think I paid 80, maybe. Maybe I hit buy it now, maybe it was a newly listed. I've been buying a lot. I just feel like he's not going to have cards in this upcoming set. I think that ultimately drives up his price of cards, just not having that second year Bowman. He's only got this year of Bowman. So 
that's been my thought process whether you believe in it or not you know that's up to you all right this would not be a mail day without a stack from dc sports 87 i did take this week off and I'll, i probably won't be buying too much just because i've been trying to save as much it's probably why my mail day is smaller this is a couple days worth but this was a pretty good stack uh i think i paid probably under 80 bucks or so it was a pretty good price per card a lot of it tops chrome stuff but started with this no fafita if i didn't win this i probably wouldn't have started a stack but really like that cracked ice there this was like three dollars he's down so bad which i get but you know whatever marshawn lynch orange love that one not numbered but love that image you've seen that a bit andre johnson orange nice one there his stuff is pretty pricey i was picking these up for a dollar or two another andre terrell owens 09 thought that was cool might not keep that one but the andres i love andre johnson that's a sick the 2009 is my favorite image I've got the copper on the way from Com C, I believe. Oh, this was just a ton of Andre. So I like Andre, probably one of my favorites. Drew Brees, nice extract. I just bought the black there. Julio, just the base, but these do about two or three bucks. I've been buying a lot of the Hall of Fame guys, the Julio, JJ Watt, Luke Keekley, a lot of the defensive guys too. Aaron Donald. I've been buying up their base cards. I just I think they're underpriced when you can get their base tops chrome rookie cards for a dollar it just doesn't make sense he's a little bit more expensive ben roethlisberger nothing huge there makai lemon been having a great year he's looking like the best freshman receiver out of bowman university 2023 imagine that i just thought he was the best value compared to where his prices were was really solid at a low salamitos you know did some things in the bowl game he's the leading receiver for usc right now we'll see what Jaden maeva does i'm not a huge maeva guy I just, I, I think it was Ricky White, you know, doing doing a lot of that work, but we'll see what happens there. Harlem Barry, he is the number one running back recruit in the country. He's going to LSU. I think he's a local Louisiana kid. Nice little black ice there. Uh, I don't mean to keep buying Cam Rising, and hopefully this is the last of it, but Cam Rising, Gold, Auto, this was like seven bucks. I'm just listing all them for like 15 to 20 bucks. Who knows if he comes back? That's the issue. Uh, mentioned it. Luke Keekley X Fractor. I like that. Don't know how much I paid for that. Flage. I think I paid about two, three bucks. That's probably about what it does. Maybe I got it for a dollar, but she should be hot. SEC preseason player of the year. So. And then Larry Fitzgerald. Bought this at a show for six bucks. Got this one for like three. I think it's just one of these cards. You send the Com C, list it for 15, and be done with it. So pretty solid stack. Pretty cheap stack from Com C. Probably one of my lowest in terms of you know price lately and now the hobby box all right and here i have a tops chrome ote 2023-24 hobby box these prices have absolutely tanked uh i don't know what they retail that but i got this the seller listed it for 24.99 free shipping and they've been doing about 35 they've dropped again i think you can get them on like all the big card shops for $27 online. I don't know if this class is underwhelming. I've, I've looked into it. It does look a little underwhelming. The autos are on a sticker now, previously on card. But I just thought for 25 bucks, two guaranteed autos. I love prospecting. I'm not huge into men's basketball, but if you can prospect high school kids, that just kind of, you know, perks my ears up a little bit more compared to like the college game. So a couple, a couple good uh, names in here, I would say. Michael Brown is definitely one of them. I think he's like number seven player in the country down to a few schools. And there's a few others in there as well. Uh, Kanon Catchings at BYU. So just 25 bucks in general. I didn't even pay $25 though. I, I've been wanting one. I passed at 35 and I was like, eh. And then I was like, you know what? I'm going to look at my eBay. I have the eBay credit card. And I like it. I, I had a 1% and a 1.5% one, one and cash back card previously. And I wasn't too thrilled. I switched to the eBay credit card and I think I like it. I only spend money on eBay basically with my cards and that credit card. So made sense. So I had a ton of rewards already. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to treat myself. I'm going to use my eBay rewards. So I paid $0 for this hobby box. So I'm excited. I wasn't going to rip it on camera, but... I went to go watch some, I went, I searched YouTube and just nobody's ripping this. And, and I don't know what, it, even like, if you want to go out and buy singles, not a lot of people are ripping it and get a case for like 300 bucks. Pretty crazy. I'm going to see if they go on sale for Black Friday. I don't know, but that's pretty much, uh, you know, why I bought this. And I like the prospecting side of things. So that's everything. If you enjoyed, drop a like, leave a comment, subscribe, watch another video, comment Buffaloes if you're a real one, and we'll see you in the next one. Love you. Bye.